Hey y'all, so I am back with another video. If you don't know who I am or this is your first time here, I go by Major Morris. Um, I also have a finance channel where I go by the House Accountants. Here on this channel, I talk about all things beauty and hair care. And on my finance channel, I talk about all things personal finance. So we are here today because I just got a delivery for some new glasses that I ordered and I wanted to just try them on in front of y'all. So here we go. These are my normal everyday glasses. They are Warby Parker. This is not paid, this is not sponsored. But if Warby y'all see me, hey. Um, so I've had these for I think a year, maybe even two at this point. I've, I think it's actually been two years. They've held up well. I haven't had to um, get them adjusted or anything like that. I just got new lenses put in these to match my new prescription. And while I was there, they were having a sale, and so I ordered two more pair of glasses. Now, the funny thing is, I tried on the glasses because, of course, we're still in Rona era, and era, and the policy of the store, at least the store where I am, is that you have to have a mask on at all times. So that's even trying on the glasses. And so when I was trying on the glasses in the store, I like the way they look, but of course you can only see from here up. So I'm interested to see how these glasses look now that I can see them against my full face. So let's go ahead and just get to trying on these glasses. So again, I went to Warby Parker. All of their glasses I think come in the same sort of packaging. This navy box with the lighter kind of ocean blue or aquamarine blue on the inside and then there's another navy uh, glasses pouch here that just flips up just like that and then your glasses are in there so that you guys i just showed you that pair this is the second pair and each pair comes with a cleansing cloth so this is the second pair I have my mirror over here so let me turn it so I thought it was turned so I could see and here we go so I think I want to try on the tortoise ones first I do not have my receipt here so I will place the name of the glasses um, somewhere on the screen so if you're interested in looking at them then you will know the name of the glasses now these look like they have some dust on them so I'm going to wipe them off really quickly I tried these on the store these came in two sizes like a small and a large or maybe narrow and wide I got the wider ones the narrow ones at least while I was in the store I could see too much of the rim of the frame when I was looking through them and the wide provided me more clearance like I don't see the rim of the actual frame in my sight so okay these aren't bad now they might look a little crooked fun fact about me my right ear sits higher than my left ear so sometimes my glasses like sit crooked and I have to get them adjusted in the store so that they don't sit like slanted on my face but okay I think they're straight are they straight? Hopefully they're straight and I don't look crazy. From what I can see, I don't know. Don't know how I feel about them. They're very nice. Don't get me wrong. They're very sturdy. They're very um, heavy. They do not have that nose. Um, the little nose pad. I typically don't like glasses with nose pads because I'm pretty rough on my glasses. I would say I wear glasses. 75% of the time and then I wear contacts the remaining 25% of the time um, I pretty much only wear contacts in the summertime so I wear sunglasses anytime other than that I'm pretty much wearing my glasses so sometimes I fall asleep in them I take a nap in them not on purpose but it happens so I need glasses that are sturdy I don't typically get dainty glasses for that reason I used to and they I just mess them up far too um, easily so I like to get a thicker, sturdier glass glasses without the nose pad. So these I really liked in the store again with my mask. Like I like them on my eyes, but now that I'm getting the full shot, I don't know 
how I feel about them. Hmm. I might have to look at them. And I don't know if it's the hairstyle. Like, would I like them if I had, like, my hair pulled back? Which I do, actually. So, if I had kind of like this ponytail situation, I do like them like this. And I don't know. I feel like they're making me look a little cross-eyed. But I do like this. Like, I think I like them with my hair pulled out of my face. I don't know that I like them as much with my hair down. And, you know, if you wear glasses, um, if you wear glasses, you kind of know that. You kind of have certain glasses for different styles, especially if you've been wearing glasses for a long time. I used to have way more glasses, but my prescription started changing too often. And so I eased up on ordering multiple pairs of glasses. But it seems like now my prescription is staying pretty steady. And now with Fermu, um, not Fermu, Lord, now with Warp Warp Parker, both of these glasses, I should probably talk about the price. Now I'm talking about this. I paid a total of two, I think 75 or no, I paid like 250 for both of these glasses. Typically Warby Parker glasses are $99 with lenses i'm pretty sure with like a basic standard lens no sort of special anything they do have other more popular glasses that are about 120. fortunately or unfortunately both of these styles that i really liked i think are on the more popular end so they were 120. and then with the lens i think it came up to 300 dollars, but they were running a special if you bought two pair two frames so i got 50 dollars off this is the second pair. I don't, I forgot what these are called. It's something with a D. Uh, again, I'll try to put the name somewhere on the screen in case you were interested in these. For some reason that day, I was really drawn to green frames. And I don't know if it's picking it up on camera because the frame is so thin. But the, the frame here is green. It's a very, very deep forest hunter green. And I like it. I actually like these a lot with my hair like this i like these a lot what y'all think now these i just gave y'all that whole spiel about dainty glasses and these are definitely i'm not gonna say flimsy because you can see like they don't really move they're not flimsy but they are a bit daintier and thinner than i typically like but i really was drawn to these that day in the store so you can see like the eye, you can see the, the what is this, the ear hook, you know, I don't know the terminology for glasses. Very thin, you see the frame itself is pretty thin. These do have that nose pad that I was talking about, which I typically don't like because they get smushed because I lay around in my glasses, but these I just won't wear probably too often I'll reserve these for if I'm going out or going to work or something where I know I won't be laying around or tempted to kind of be too rough with them even though I'm sure what happens sooner or later but I do like these let's see if we pull the same move let me put my hair up hmm what y'all think I like these too they're giving me very you know librarian educator um you know i'm here to teach you something i'm here to read you a book these are giving me very intellectual vibes which i think leave comments in the comment section below but here we are i like these i think they're cute i think i like these right now more than i like these but i do I have, to, I have to give myself some time with these because I'm not sure how I feel about these right now. I have to give myself some time. I don't know how I'm feeling about these. I typically like a bigger frame. These are a lot smaller than I'm used to getting. Like they fit my face. I'm using. I'm used to getting an oversized frame that sits really wide. I think those fit me and my face really well. These, I just, I feel like they're making me look cross-eyed or something. So, we'll see 
how I feel about these. Um, most glasses companies have some sort of maybe 14 day policy. If you don't like a, a pair of the glasses, then you can return them or exchange them. So we'll see. I have to see what Warby Parker's um, policy is. This is only the second time I've ordered glasses from them. They came pretty quickly. Um, I think they came... The turnaround window that they gave me was 15 business days. And it, that was about how long it took. It took between 10 and 15 business days. So they were right on time. They didn't really get held up or anything. Um, so I think that is it. If you have insurance, I know there's a possibility that you can use your insurance with Warby Parker. They just don't work with all insurances. So you would have to check before you actually made a purchase if your insurance does work with Warby Parker or if, or if your insurance covers Warby Parker classes. So I think that's it. Like I said, this is not, you know, sponsored in any way. But if y'all see me, Warby, reach out to your girl. And yeah, I think that is it for this video i just wanted to do something quick fun unbox my little new uh lenses with you all and i will see you all in the next video